We are diving into the mysterious world of baby cries. If you've ever wondered what your little one is trying to tell you, you are in the right place. Today, we will decode five different types of baby cries and what they mean. Let's get started. Yeah. Experts have decoded these baby cries and I'm here to share them with you all, my yummy mommies. Remember, every baby is unique, but these general guidelines can help you understand their needs better. Cry number one, the hungry cry. This is usually the most common cry parents hear. It's redemic and repetitive. It sounds like ne, ne, ne. Babies use their sucking reflex to make this sound which means, hey, I'm hungry, give me food now. <laughs> hungry cries can start softly and become more intense if not addressed quickly. This is like your baby's way of escalating the message. Some babies might also smack their lips or suck on their hands as additional hunger cues. So watch out for these too and grab a bottle when it happens or get ready to breastfeed. Cry number two the tired cry. This one is a bit whiny and sounds like oh, oh, oh sound. Not so serious. It's usually accompanied by yawns and rubbing of eyes. Babies get cranky when they are sleepy, just like we do. So when you hear this cry, try to get your baby to a quiet, comfortable place where they can drift off to sleep. Also dress them in a comfortable way too. It's important to establish a bedtime routine. Here's a tip. Dim the lights and use white noise or gentle lullabies to create a soothing environment for your baby. Cry number three, the pain cry. This type of cry is usually sharp, loud, intense and comes on suddenly. It's more of a shrill piercing wail and can be quite alarming. This cry usually means something is causing discomfort, like a tummy ache, a diaper rash, or something else. Check for anything that might be hurting your baby. Reposition your baby to be something as simple as a hair wrapped around a tiny finger or a toe. Or maybe they are cheating. If you can't find the source and the cry gets more severe, kindly call your pediatrician. Cry number four. The discomfort cry. This one is more fuzzy and irritable, like eh, eh, eh. It's often due to a filled up diaper that is causing this discomfort, or your baby just wants a change in position. Make sure your baby is comfortable, dry, and dressed appropriately for the weather. Sometimes just changing their position or giving them a little tummy time can make a huge difference. Okay, cry number five, the need for attention cry. Generally, babies are attention seekers. <laughs> this cry is often heard. It sounds like neh, heh, heh, and usually happens when your baby just wants to be held or is looking for some cuddles. Babies need love, attention. They need to feel safe, and sometimes they just want to be close to you. When you hear this cry, Give your baby some extra hugs and all the love they need. Give them some reassurance. It's a great time to bond and show them that you are there for them. Okay? You can also use this opportunity to engage in some gentle play or sing a lullaby. Okay? Yeah. There you have it. Remember, every baby is different. And it might take some time to understand your little one's unique cries and signs. But with a little patience and a lot of love, you will get the hang of it. I would have shown you the real baby crying, but my own baby is more than age one. So, till I come your way next time, thanks for watching my loves. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and hit that bell icon so you never miss out an update. Leave a comment below. It's a question that you have, okay? And do well to check out my other videos on baby foods and weight gain foods. You will love it. See you in my next one. Bye. Love you.